So hello guys, this is Alvis565 here and today we are unboxing this laptop, it's an Asus X553M or 553M, I don't know. So uh, in terms of boxes, it's simple, it's plain box in search of incredible Asus, um, a bunch of other stuff like caution because it has a lithium batteries. And that's about it. So we're gonna open it, and uh, let's see what's inside. Uh, this laptop is actually it's not for me; it's for my brother. So yeah. Um, let's see what's what we get. Uh, we get uh, uh, first of all we get the power supply, which is kind of small for a laptop this price uh, because companies don't invest much in power supplies and. This is quite small, this, which is great. Um, L more, this is just a bag, random bag. That's about it. So, some... Some protection, I don't know why. And the laptop in the bag. There's something else. Let's take this away a bit, for a second. And we've got a... Uh, we've got a uh, manual, so... Uh, let's put this away. Uh, so, taken out of the box, it looks kind of good. Oh, it has a very nice texture, um, like a brushed aluminum feel, uh, but it's plastic, so it's pretty nice. I like it. Um, on the, which is the left side, if you look, uh, you've got power in, it looks like an Ethernet, Ethernet port. Um, DVI, HDMI, USB 3, car SD card reader, and USB 2, and uh, mic and the headphone jack, combined one. Uh, on the back, you find nothing at all. On the right side, you find a Kensington lock and uh, an optical drive, which is kind of nice. And the front is clean as well. So, uh, bottom is kind of clean as well. Wow, this I'm kind of impressed. It's got... Um, so the bottom, you can see two speakers, and there are no ventilation. So I don't actually know how you how do you ventilate this. We're gonna see in a second. Um, most laptops do it by the hinge, which is probably the case here. So so the most modern laptops use uh, this hinge to use as a vent ventilation, but it looks like it's uh, used in this one as well. This kind of a low, low end, and yeah, the cover does actually pick up fingerprints, which is bad. So let's see what um, the inside looks like in this laptop. Um, it looks surprisingly well. Um, it has a full-size keyboard, a uh, pretty nice touchpad, into the outside. Yeah, full-size keyboard, which is nice. Uh, yeah, everything is pretty nice. The keyboard, the feel, the feel is pretty good for a non-mechanical keyboard. So let's see if it actually powers on and see if if it has an OS because I don't know okay, the uh, screen turns on this is in search of incredible um, there's a cor cursor oh, the tr yeah, the trackpad feels nice but there's, oh, okay so, uh, when booting in, uh, it looks oh very good for this 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 display. Looks very good. Um, it's responsive. Uh, I had to activate Windows and stuff. It were pretty responsive. But um, personally, no. Uh, this trackpad feels weird. Like there's some acceleration going on. So I personally don't like that. I will see if I can do anything about that. But. But we'll see. So, yeah, that's about it. Um, so, thanks for watching, guys, and see you guys in the next video. Bye.